what's up? We're the heirs, and we're going to describe some of our pre-show rituals. I don't, I don't think we all have them, but I know I have, uh, um, I have some. So, uh, our Warp Tour is sponsored by Monster, and actually what we all are drinking on stage isn't actually Monster, it's Tour Water, but pre-show, pre I, and I think a handful of us, we all have the juice. The, oh, I like it's the, the, the pink. It's in the pink one. That's my favorite. Pink yeah, I like the, the peach juice. tea. Oh yeah, you oh. get the black one. The peach yeah, tea. The peach yeah, the peach tea. The right. rehab one. Yeah. Uh, but so we all drink those. Like once I started like drinking like one or half of one before a show, I started realizing that I would, I would literally bounce off the stage a lot more. So that was kind of like it was a better performance overall. Uh, and then. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was <laughs> sick. And it landed in your hair. Um, other pre-show ritual, I typically like to kind of get my heart rate going a little bit. So I do either high knees or jumping on and off. Uh, cases. Um, cases, yeah. Or whatever little like. I would say we all kind of do like the whole monster thing before it gets us amped. Yeah. One thing for me is I, recently on this tour, for the first time ever, like I, I was never super into like hardcore rock or like anything like that. It was more different kind of styles of music for me. But like recently before shows, I'll like, drink a monster and I'll put my ears in and like or my, my headphones in and I'll just like listen to like some, some music that's more hardcore and I'll just like, oh yeah, I'm ready for the show. So it, it really pops me out. The thing that's really funny is like I try every show to get us into like a, a pre-show huddle or something. And that's the ironic thing and about it. Never this, happens. Is, like, everyone's always like so busy and so in the moment, you know, you don't really have sound checks or anything on on warp, so you set up your shit and you go. Yeah. So like, we've gotten so used to that that every time I try to get the group huddle going, everybody's in their own world, which is totally funny. But yeah. we have done it several times. Yeah. Usually, just like it's been settle sick. on sports. Like we'll just be like, okay, one, two, three, sports. Yeah. And that's that's kind of our thing. Yeah. I don't know why. I'm typically like pretty pretty in my own world before our shows. Like I'll have <laughs> my guitar doing like my, my little warm ups and all my hand stretches and all that kind of stuff. And occasionally, Brandon will come over, like kind of bounce on his toes. And Jumps a little bit with we'll slap, slap each other a little yeah. bit. slap each other across mm -hmm. the face a couple times. Yeah, yeah, Brandon has this weird with, with this weird pre-show which will be like eats just loads of a uh, cotton candy. Just like loads. just like tons of it. Just right before. It makes it feel real I good. love to vomit when I perform. Cotton so. <laughs> <laughs> like candy it really out. helps. Cotton candy vomit. really helps it out, so it's great. Yeah. <laughs> so I think those are our pre-show rituals. Come to a show and check them out for yourself. You'll see the vomit. One of those was a lie. You'll have to figure out which one. And by the way, <laughs> that thing, below, that thing that you might have saw me shooting, there were two coffee cups on top of the coffee maker, and I whacked them both off. It was sick. We're all really proud. He actually missed. Proud. But, uh, That's the first time he's ever hit anything.